Hey there everyone, Electro here, and today I'm going to show you how you can create a format filter in Audio Tool. I've been trying to wrap my head around this for the past little while, and I think I've finally figured out how it is you can do this. Now a lot of tutorials exist out there that show you how you can make these kind of format filter sounds in different programs, but usually it's the format filters already built into the synthesizer, and places don't really tell you how you can manually make these filters yourself. So essentially the way it works is by running a sound through multiple bandpass filters in parallel and combining them together. The bandpass filters are set at very specific frequencies with a high resonance. So I'm going to show you how you can do this right now. First thing you're going to want to do is create a synthesizer. And you're going to want to set it to something with a high sustain and very resonant patch. I recommend saws. And you're going to want about two oscillators, just for a richness. Make sure to set your sustain. Good. Now I'm going to want to make a long sustain note in the piano roll. This is just so you can test out your filtering to hear how it sounds. Alright, now that we have that out of the way, we can get to the interesting part. You're going to want to make a splitter with three different channels. For each of those channels, you're going to want to put one filter effect and one comp. The reason for the comps, by the way, is just to control the amplitude of each different signal path. Now wire everything together in parallel. Okay, good. Now set all your filters to bandpass with a high resonance. Okay, now for the next step. What you see here is a listing I found on the internet of all the different vowel sounds and their bass formant frequencies. So you'll see all the different vowel sounds and three numbers beside them. That represents the frequency cutoffs for your three different filters that you've made. So if I want to make an oo sound, I would use the frequencies 300, 870, and 2250. So let's set our filters to that now. The first one's already set to 300, so I'm good. If we check our list, the second one is 870. Remember to hold shift and control so you can get more precise movement on your knob. It may take a little patience. Our third and final frequency is 2250, so I'm going to set my frequency to that. All 
All right, let's have a listen to how that sounds. Ooh. Feel free to try the different vowel sounds and play with the amplitude on your compressors to get something that suits your taste. This is Electro signing off.